Diane, tell me a little bit about Bob's service here at the YMCA and what he has meant to the YMCA over 48 years. Yeah, it's, it's almost impossible to describe all that he has meant to the Y over 48 years. Um, but when I think of Bob, the first thing that comes to my mind is the fact that he, more than anyone I've ever known, really lives Y values. Um, that he has always been honest and caring and responsible and respectful of everyone. And we also strive here to be inclusive. Um, and I see Bob doing that not only in his role at the Y, but certainly in his role as a community leader in every way. So it's been an honor to work with him and he has often served as a role model for me. When I'm looking at issues that are complex and I'm conflicted about them, I often think about, you know, what would Bob bring to this in terms of his judgment? And so I've been very grateful to have the opportunity to work with him. Okay, and what about for you? What, is, what has it been like, you know, being here for 48 years? 48 years, it's a long time. I often joke about the fact that um, the Y and I have grown up together over the 48 years. Me from a, um, you know, 14-year-old, uh, eventually long-haired high school student with, uh, to uh, where I am today, a leader in the community, and, and the Y from, um, you know, always always the heart of the, the Madison area community and continue to be so, but reaching out to people in different ways. And so it's uh, been a, an incredible ride that I don't think anyone would want to miss. Okay.